Hi Scorpio, welcome in. You're watching the Sacred Sun Tarot. Let's see what's happening in love lives of Scorpio. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter. Reverse the rules if needed. Switch the cases. May I be your reading entirely right? I never try to impose a reading on your situation. If it's meant for you, it's going to connect to you naturally. Scorpio. Overall, Scorpio, I see two of pentacles. Some struggles, some decision-making, confusion. This is better, this is not. Are you doing window shopping, Scorpio? We have the star energy. Wonderful. Hoping. Hoping for something beautiful. And, and you know what? I do see that you're making very careful decisions here with the two of pentacles. It's a very careful decision-making process. Don't You just want to avoid mistake, right? But at the same time, I see a beautiful hope associated. For some of you, I'm picking up that you might be getting enlightened. You might be getting some new and fresh hope very soon. And it is that care and concern that I need to carry it very carefully, right? Let's see what was the recent past. What was the recent past for Scorpio? I see Chariot, Empress and the Four of Cups. Ten of Pentacles energy. Commitment, bond, marriage, relationship and some kind of family situation, right? I see mother here. So for some of you, this can be a mother figure. For rest of you, Scorpio, I see that you want... Uh, there was a situation which brought in a lot of hope and willpower that, that ignited some kind of willpower in you and you decided to move on from something, right? There was something that made you feel, made you realize your, your self-worth, right? Something made you realize your self-worth and uh, you walked out of something gracefully. You came out of something gracefully, right? And you became very uh, selective. I see that you're turning down a lot of stuff here, turning down proposals, turning out down options. For some of you, I see a feeling that I need to find somebody who can match my energy, right? Match my uh, willpower, match my personality for some of you, right? I see you are understanding your self-worth and nothing in your surroundings is actually matching that position. We have, okay, Knight of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles, Page of Swords. Now some opportunity is coming in. That is catching your interest. So maybe that's the star energy that you are gaining some kind of hope and desire when it comes to this opportunity, right? Something fresh is coming in. You're skeptical, dicey, analyzing it. And you're getting the background check, knowing more about it. But uh, this is definitely commit about commitment. So maybe this opportunity is about commitment. The one who is coming in, they want to marry. They want to uh, maybe just move in together, right? I see some family gathering also here. Oh, beautiful. Two of Cups, Queen of Wands, and the Page of Cups. Oh my God, Three of Wands. I, I, I see some kind of energy that, is it for real? Is it for real? Can I trust this? This is so exciting. Two of Cups, Queen of Wands and Page of Cups. Past so many readings were more like a single Scorpio looking for love and, uh, you know, more readings were somehow dominated by singlehood and uh, looking for a partner, meeting people, going on dates, right? I see that now something will click. Queen of Wands energy, if you are a Scorpio female, I see this is your energy. You are appearing so attractive, so, so beautiful. I see someone is coming in with a lot of compliments, Scorpio. You look at them, they look at you, and something is going to click. And that, will, that will be so instant. That will be so instant connection, I'm sorry. Such an instantaneous connection that I see someone coming head over heels for you. Can you see this page of cups? Wow, like I see this person is short of words, how to express what they're exactly feeling for you beautiful energy and uh, i'm getting chills here this is this is very romantic you know looking at somebody the moment you see you click and you're like oh my god <laughs> and this person is someone who is going to value your personality your beauty your appearance you are the queen of fawns and they're going to appreciate it right until now i see you were quite dissatisfied because uh, you were understanding 
your position your background for some of you you belong to a very good position you're working at a very good level something was there because of which somehow you were not very satisfied about the kind of proposals you were getting or the kind of partner you wanted in your life that was a search i'm picking up it was continuously there on your mind right what is this two of pentacles energy for scorpio two of pentacles energy we have six of cups okay we have lovers and hermits so i see maybe a choice i see water sign energy i see gemini and virgo energy right there's a choice between for some of you i'm picking up there's a choice between a past person and a new virgo entering the scenes right so some kind of choices there and it's struggleful for some of you i'm also getting a message that you want to avoid hasty decisions and that's why hermit energy is here so being very careful of what you pick amazing king of swords making logical decisions here let's see what is this four of cups despite of having such wonderful energetic energies why you were so dissatisfied when it comes to the proposals in your surroundings yep i see seven of wands you were blocking something you were not happy with kind of uh, options coming your way i see you resisting it yes in the recent past i see you blocked something and you walked out three of cups maybe you met someone for the first time or you met someone once it was a meeting gathering you enjoyed but that was not a click right and uh, then for someone i'm picking up that it did result in some kind of argument but for rest of you i see it was a silent turning down right and five of swords i will be victorious a feeling that i'll be successful for some of you i'm picking up that there is a feeling of uh, self-worth and uh, self-love right because of this feeling some people in your surroundings might get disappointed right for someone i'm also getting a message that someone's mother is thinking that they are quite self-centered and uh, they're being too selective picky when it comes to love right but uh, this is not what you're thinking and this is not how you are looking at the picture you are more taking it like it's my life and i want to make it i want to make the best out of it so if i want to wait on to love if i want to look for more options look for more people and i want to be very selective that's okay if i'm selective i just don't want to make any mistake i want i don't want to compromise for some of you i'm also picking up that this is going to be my once in a lifetime uh, thing like you know it's like once i'll settle down it will be forever so i want to be very careful when i pick the right person right i see someone very choosy here knight of pentacles something is coming in towards you oh justice yes i see libra energy right and i see a kind of person who is quite bold right right for some of you i'm picking up that the proposal coming towards you is from somebody who has a personality of maybe a judge maybe someone working at a higher authority this person is very honest very fair and uh, they will come up to you and tell you exactly how they feel they won't lie not the kind of person who will lie yes and they're coming with this an opportunity with this opportunity they are uh, quite interested i see in the beginning you might get a conversation from this person it might not be face to face yet but the moment you're going to see each other face to face i see instant connection and this person will be like you know praising you appreciating you flirting around giving you compliments and they're very impressed they're very impressed and they're going to be very impressed when they're going to look at you first seven of pentacles yes for some of you i'm also getting a picture here uh, scorpio that you are somehow getting satisfied with this pentacle there are a lot of pentacles in the options but you were like no nothing satisfies me but this one is very interesting right this one is very interesting page of pentacles wow they're coming in to talk i see someone especially preparing a pentacle for you especially preparing a cup for you by that it means that someone is actually putting in some effort you know it's like thinking about the lines they'll say and for some of you this even can be a present they're bringing for you my god this is quite romantic you are skeptical you are uh, <laughs> looking at them 
in and out and uh, looking for more information i don't really see that you're settling down very easily again there are thoughts and fears that i don't want to settle for anything right i want to be very careful when i settle down and there's an emotion that i will go out i will meet them knight of wands in and out energy i'm not sure if i'll settle for it i am very decisive but at least i'll go and meet right uh, i'll go and meet that's the emotion i'm picking up that in the beginning you'll be very casual and quite disinterested thinking that i don't know so yeah queen of swords logical very logical very tactful and uh, opening up the way what you think being very vocal about your requirements terms conditions and i see all the plans set on your mind that i'm just going to go and say this that's it right we'll see later on the moment you'll see them there will be a click sudden click two of cups oh my god the sun the three of cups and the eight of swords and suddenly you will feel so confused that you were planning so much you were thinking so much and you know all the kind of uh, doubts were there on your mind and the moment you both will look at each other there will be sudden happiness there will be an instant connection instant click and you'll be so happy three of cups with the sun and eight of swords energy my god it is actually some kind of blindfold you're feeling out of confusion now what i thought this and in reality it's it's something else it's exactly not what you think totally other way around right okay knight of swords energy yes it's coming in very quickly very very quickly scorpio and it is bringing in so so much hope for you right so much hope for you star we also have okay six of swords yes i do see a partnership here right potential partnership i do see some things have to be settled before you settle down completely you commit to somebody or you're moving on from something and you have a lot of doubts when it comes to settlement and relationship but trust me i see new love coming in right and they are coming in with this conversation what is this page of cups energy hanged man eight of wands and seven of cups seven of swords energy here scorpio i see you're carrying a lot of doubts a lot of thoughts right and these thoughts and doubts are somehow causing overthinking on your mind right i see you will take some time we have hanged man with the eight of wands energy you will take time to analyze it to understand it for some of you i pick up that uh, they will make continuous efforts to connect with you after a phase of delay i see when you will meet first there will be some light conversation and then there will be a gap a little bit of gap in between and then some intense conversation is going to come your way right it might appear very confusing but at the same time you will see the situation from all the sides two of pentacles energy you're analyzing i see the phase where you're continuously analyzing the situation ins outs and you are thinking about all the options available right deep contemplation and then you will make the decision it's very interesting but i think they are decided the moment they will look at you they'll feel yes scorpio is the one this is very interesting this is very romantic scorpio sun moon rising venus jupiter so what messages uh, what advices do we have for scorpio balance i bring a state of perfect balance and harmony into my world and i do so without judgment so you are strongly advised scorpio here that don't be don't carry any judgments when you plan to meet this person or uh, maybe you are not yet decided that you have to meet somebody or not or you have somebody on your mind but you're clearly being advised not to carry any judgments oh my god we have judgment here again i understand that everyone has their own unique paths and challenges so you have to understand that uh, when you meet somebody new that person comes from a totally different world and you are from a totally different world different experiences different childhood different upbringing everything different and when you come together it's a big uh, encounter right it is and when you decide to settle with somebody it is an altogether change in your life as well as their life so 
what you call for is that do not carry any mindset any outlook when it comes to love new love relationship commitment try to have an open mind and accept this person for what they are and if you are willing to move forward in this connection do so without any preconceived notions right i see that will be much more easier and simple simpler to grow in this connection i'm picking up for someone right beautiful we have grief i understand that losing something is an opportunity to appreciate it i see that i see a very i see a very long phase of delay and contemplation thinking analyzing going on and somewhere at heart you do have this fear also that what if i lose this opportunity right this is very good opportunity i'm picking up for someone this person is actually very romantic and a kind of partner you can think of right so that is important that uh, you think about the situation completely and make the decision change i understand that nothing can grow or evolve without movement so definitely some kind of movement is needed and this movement is not just a physical movement this is some kind of i see change that is needed in your outlook right if an outlook is stagnant for so long that becomes redundant right we have to change as per our surroundings as per our needs and requirements so i see some outlook changes needed here scorpio urgently service i feel good when i can help others wow this is very compassionate very compassionate energy i trust so trust i accept that my inner voice will always guide me correctly try to listen to your intuition scorpio you are being guided correctly you are being uh, advised correctly by your intuition by your conscience right and uh, be vocal about your requirements but at the same time think about the situation deeply oh my god see we have crossed again i accept my inner voice will guide me correctly right we'll have one more card and then we will wind up the reading worry i'm learning that worry doesn't change any outcome so if you're thinking about the situation or i should say if you're overthinking about the situation stop worrying stop thinking about it guilt i release any beliefs that no longer resist in my soul's growth let go of past i see you had some tough experiences in the past and that's why you have become too selective when it comes to the matters of heart let go of the past overthinking cannot change any outcome All you need to do is have an open mind and see this person as someone unique and a bit different. So are you, right? So that can help you work out the situation and uh, yeah, these are the messages I have for you. Thank you so much guys for watching. Bye-bye.